Hey guys, it's your girl and welcome back to the channel and today, today I finally, finally, finally here with Life of Brooklyn. Now, before y'all say, but nay, this ain't their house. Yes it is. They in there. They sleep. They, they, they doing what they need to do. Now, a little story time. So, in the last episode of The Single Father... I said life of Brooklyn wasn't working. And that is true. Because every time I try to record um them in and um them in uh El Salvador, it broke. So I was like, nah. So why are they in a new house? Because um baby girl, Miss Kendra is about to age up and um today, like she's about to have her her birthday today so today is really all about her and what she wants to do but but back to what I was saying why are they in the new house while Brooklyn and Shane were on this vacation they decided they was like bear house is too small and we need a bigger house we need a forever house because Kendra's getting older and she's gonna move out soon and you know that's not enough space and I want a house that we don't have to keep buying and building on. So he was like, okay, let's look at it. Let's go to the bank. Let's see how much money we got. And so they sold the old house and they got the new one. So we are going to do a house tour and everything. Um, And secondly, well, not secondly, thirdly, Brooklyn's um vet got uh deleted i don't know how i just went to the vet one day and it said you don't want a vet so what are you talking about so i had to buy a new vet i had to um i had to um hire some new employees and like fix that and so i did so i'm very excited to show you all the new and improved winter family like i just i love this lp so much I wanted to find a way to reinvent it um so what we're going to be doing in this episode like I said is what we're going to do if I say what we're going to do one more time what is going to happen is we are going to age up Kendra in this episode and then the next episode we're either going to have a party or we're going to have her party on the weekend because today's a Tuesday so all her friends are at school so Today's a Tuesday. We're going to have a party on Saturday because people got things to do. So we're going to age Kendra up and then her friends are going to take her out for lunch. And then she's going to have her spooky day party on the weekend. And then we have kind of some little friends that I want her to meet and stuff. So, yeah. All right. So let's get into the episode. It's currently probably like 2 a.m because Brooklyn's up and she usually gets up around 2 a.m. in my game so yeah let's see what time it is it's 2 54 don't I know my sims lord I know my sims I miss them so much and it and if y'all see the dogs aren't here just because I haven't got them yet this house is really really new and I swear as soon as I get Bo back they're all going to pee on everything so they're not they're not coming back until the next episode because this house is brand new so like I said this is a new house I like the layout of this house a lot more so they have um the front area of the house they have the laundry room and like this house is still a work in progress because I didn't build Shane's like his wizard room I wanted to build him his own like what is it called? It's not called a layer because layers are for vampires. So what is it called? It's called, um, what is it called? I don't know what it's called. Somebody let me know in the comments. And this video might be really, really short because it's my mother's birthday. So everybody go say happy birthday to my mama. She been 25 for the last 40 years of her life. But it's okay. But it's okay. We love her. We love her. So Miss Thang is going to get up. And she is finna to go use the bathroom, take her a shower. And like, like I really wanted this lot 
because they got an ocean. So Brooklyn no longer has to swim in that little pool and she can teach Kendra how to use her powers and stuff and, and be a little mentor. That's what she really wanted to do. Um, so if my game would act right, you know what, you know what, you know what game? You know what? Just, just, just stop. Come and brush your teeth. So they have the top floor all to themselves. Like I said, there's a lot more stuff that's going to be going into this little build or what have you. Girl, I know you hungry. You're going to come downstairs and cook for your husband and your kids. So like I said, this house, I really like the like the size of it and everything. It's still a work in progress. I still got a lot of rooms to um, put in and to do. So... Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and have her cook a gourmet meal because she can and because of why not. Oh, no, she can't. Well, we need to make breakfast. That's what we need to do. We need to make breakfast. And then after you make breakfast, who has pasta for breakfast? I love to have pasta for breakfast. That's like the best thing ever. Um, if my game would work, please, thank you. Come on. Like, like, come on. So, y'all, I'm debating if I want to get the PS5. I'm really debating if I want to get it. Like, like, I'm debating. Because I don't want to get the PS5 because there's so much hype around it. But then at the same time, I'm like, I want the PS5. So I can play the Harry Potter game. And don't shoot me in my comments because I like Harry Potter. I have a sim self. And then I have a mermaid that's married to a spellcaster that has mermaid and spellcaster children. I'm weird. It's okay. Don't even try and like, and just, just don't. Don't even try to understand me because you won't be able to. So, and to be honest, with this family in particular, I really like the generations to continue. So, this is probably one of my, going to be one of my opening generations that we're just going to see everybody. And it's going to be great. It's going to be wonderful. Um, and then, like, you know how Sims the spinoffs and of other like things and stuff so I want to do that but that's no uh, okay my camera doesn't want me to talk that's not until you know Kendra gets older and she figure figures out what she wants to do I kind of know like where I want her to age up at um so what is going to happen like I know what traits I want to give her I know what aspiration I want her to have and yeah. And every time I make this family, they got some more money. Look, yeah, they're these two are not poor individuals. And not meaning they're rich either. They live well. They have money. They have a nice set of, you know, they have a nice set of everything. And so they're finally in a job where they can um you know um get raised and get everything that they need to get um and Brooklyn was supposed to Brooklyn was supposed to um yeah she's level no she was supposed to because like my game glitched out so hold on because I got her up two more levels than this and I don't know what it is so I'm guessing that it's this. So, you know what? I'll fix it later. I'll fix it after the thing. Because I swear to God, my game glitched out. Because Shane got up like two levels after I brought them home. Because I wanted to get some playtime. So I brought them home and I got them working on their work stuff. If you hear my phone go off, it's my Discord in the background. So all of my friends are typing in the Discord. And I haven't texted anybody back because I've been busy 
with school. So I'm taking a break from like school for like an hour and then I'm going back to it when I finish. Um, I also, I'm probably going to do their new outfits off camera, so it's not going to be a big thing. He's going to go take a shower. Brooklyn is going to go make this cake. Um, I really want her to make, you know what, I'm, you make the pasta, you make the breakfast, and then you come down and you make the cake. How about that? Okay, calm down. And I really like it because look, y'all, they have a dining room table now. They have a dining room table. They didn't have a dining room table in our house because I forgot. And I, I, I didn't really want to put it back in there. So they now have a dining room table. If my game would load, and we're making a coconut cake, correct? Yes, we are. Um, it's weird because, like, ooh, Shane, you all dirty. I'm sorry, friend. Girl, go make this food for this man before he die of starvation or hunger or whatever the heck it is. Um, so the kids' rooms, I. These were two rooms, and I just combined them together. I deleted the wall and just put them together. I don't really think the boys should, you know, have two separate rooms because they're boys. They can share. Kendra really needed her own room, and by the way, it's very, very, um, uh, very, very, um, you know, fit for a teenager. And I did a lot of work on making this room, and she has her own bathroom in her room so she has her own little space and then they have a, a boat they have a float they just have everything and I love them and I'm going to give them everything just because I can and it's my game um so I still have to set a lot of things in motion and I have to finish the house so um I'm going to finish the house in the next couple episodes um, I know a lot of people love this family. I love this family. It's been so long since I've seen everybody. And Brooklyn looks skinny. What the hell is happening? Y'all, Brooklyn looks skinty. She ain't got no meat on her no more. What happened? Oh, we need to fix that. You need to eat. Hell no. You need to go eat something. You need to go. Ooh, yeah, you need to eat. Because you look, you look skinty. You think you're cute with your hair, and yes, you're cute, but you look skinty. I don't like it. Your makeup is cute, but you look skinty. I don't like it. Fix it. You need to gain some weight. Um, yeah, but I really like this whole family dynamic, and yes, in my head, Brooklyn is in her, you know, I don't know, because... I want Brooklyn and Shane to stay young adults forever, but I know that can't really happen because they're who they are. So, um, yeah. I feel like you're going to eat her cake, and I really don't want you to eat her cake. So I kind of need you to, um, I kind of need you to, you know, be father of the year. So we made Kendra's favorite food, which is pasta. She likes Brooklyn's pasta. And we didn't really want to make spaghetti. The boys love spaghetti. So she didn't really, she made all of Kendra's favorite foods. And so we're having pasta for breakfast. The boys are sleeping. So hopefully they'll sleep through the, um, the whole entire like morning and won't get up. But, um, I kind of need y'all to hurry up so we can age her up and then her thing will be at the end of the episode. Girl, come sit. You shouldn't be standing up eating. You can throw up like that. That's not cute. And why are y'all sitting like so far away from each other? Here, sit here. Oh, this is yours. Your, your daddy bought that for you. There you go. Come and sit and eat your food. And then who's going to make the cake? I told Shane to make the cake, right? What is happening? Where are you going? 
to where? No, you are not making popcorn. Yo, yo, yo. You pissed me off, and it's too early in the morning. It's only 5.30 in a.m., and you're pissing me off already. Can you eat your food? Can you eat your food? She cooked for you, and you didn't even eat. You didn't even eat. What is happening? How is this a new house, and you're glitching already? Would you eat your food? Y'all, this has been almost 14 minutes of nothing. I usually record for 30 minutes, but uh, I don't know if I'm going to record for 30 minutes because I, I really don't know. Um, and a lot of things are still to happen in this LP. Like, we got to get these two knuckleheads married. We got to get, we got to find a dress for Brooklyn to wear. We got to go bridal shopping. We have to have a bachelorette party. We have to have a bachelor party. Um, we need to age up the twins. We need to consider if, um, you know, where Kendra's going to school and if she's going to school and if she's not and stuff. So, yeah, um, they need to hurry up because I'm really trying to age her up so I can give her a makeover. I'm overly excited to give her a makeover. You don't understand. I am very excited to give her a makeover like I'm like I'm overly here for it Brooklyn if you don't stop talking to him you've been with him for last week y'all been doing what y'all been doing for last week now can you make this girl her cake so we can age her up a cake should be under bake because you don't cook a cake you bake it that really made me upset I don't know why it made me so upset but it did it made me really upset it made me really upset. Like, really, 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 really. So, I would say Kendra really likes... She likes the blue confetti cake and coconut cake. So, I think we're going to go with um, the coconut cake. Because we're going to do the zombie cake for her party. And I... Because I wanted to do, like, a like a spooky-themed party because of Halloween. And so that's what we're doing. We are going to make her some cake. And then hopefully her friends are going to pick her out. Or not. I don't know. It depends. Because I don't think I'll be able to do all of that. So you know what? We'll do that on the day of her party. Girl, where are you going? Where are you going? How about we not do that? Um, Yeah, how about we not do that? I actually need to get her mom. So I can do her makeover. And um, I think I've already did that. If I didn't, then okay. But uh, yeah. So I think where we're leaving off is that we are just going to give her a makeover. If Brooklyn can make a cake fast enough. Um, Brooklyn, if you don't hurry up, I'm going to have to three speed you. Because you're taking all day. You're taking all day, ma'am. And I don't got all day. I really don't. I don't really have all day for you to just be this slow. You're being slow. I don't I don't like it. I don't get it. It's not it. I'm not here for it. It's not what it needs to be. Okay? I, I I'm not here for it. And my mom just got home. So you just taking the long day to day. You just doing what you want, huh? You just you really doing what you want. You are really doing what you want, and you are playing my last nerve. You really are. Um, you are playing my last nerve. And did I pause the game? I paused the game. I paused it. Can you hurry the hell up, please? Okay, y'all. Your girl is back. I just had to go look at something and it was, um, it was just taking me a while. Um, I'm actually going to, well, I went, no, where is your, your father? Like, what is happening? Where is your father? Where is your father? Everything is already a mess and it hasn't even been 
one day in the new house. Bring your butt over here. Teleport right here. Thank you. Get up. Get up. The babies are going to start crying. So I suggest you get your butt over here. Kendra, are you ready to age up, my love? I'm so excited. Y'all, they're going to mess her up. They're going to mess her cute self up. She's going to be so messed up. They're going to mess her up so bad. We're going to have her make a wish. And she's going to age up, my baby. My baby. My pretty, pretty little baby. I love her. I just love her. Oh, Yay! Okay. Kendra aged up. Teendom. Romantic travels. Ooh. They did not say travels. I don't know what that say. I can't see. But I know it don't say travels. Uh, sweaty gym shorts and hormonal up heels. A weight. Best buckle th those boots. The ride starts here. Girl. Girl. Um, so first for her aspiration, I really wanted to go with um, either creative or like, um, or like, you know, popularity. Cause I want her to be a world famous celebrity because I wanted her to use her stuff to be great. So I'm going to go with the um, creative one and as she grows up, we can kind of change it. Um, she's definitely just, you know what, you know what, that's wrong. Don't listen to me. I'm wrong. I don't know what I'm talking about. Um, We are going with, hold on, hold on, hold on, I'm breaking, I'm breaking stuff and I don't know why. My phone is, like, stuck in my headphones, and it's pissing me off. Okay. Okay. Now I can act like I know how to record a video, because this is a mess. I wanted her to focus on being creative and stuff. So that is, like, one thing that I want her to do. But her aspiration is more of, you know, just, like, being a family person. She is, she is a really like she loves her family and she's very over overprotective of her family and you will see that as she grows up so we are giving her the successful lineage family she wants a family that succeeds in life because her parents succeeded in life Brooklyn and Shane are her parents and they have succeeded in life um and also I want to give her the um art lover like act the art lover trait she gonna get some more but usually it's going it, the first one is going to be art lover if i can find it where is art lover i see creative but i don't now we are going to jump into cast give her her makeover and then we're gonna end the episode so i'll see y'all when we get to cast You don't even know me like that Are you past my time? Put you on my mind Come a little closer like that Staying up all night Throwing drinks back Blue eyes smiling while you're cursing I admit it's working
Like I wanted her to. Um, I'm going to keep editing the whole entire family. So by the next part, everything will be together. I know this part was a little bit jumbled. And I was talking about a whole bunch of things. So like I said, next episode we are having Kendra's like Halloween birthday party. But she's not going to age up. We're just going to have a house party. And we are going to have... Um, um, like the family and Shane's family and hopefully Kendra's mom's family I forgot about them to be honest and I really want them to play a part in like the, the, the party so we're gonna go by and meet them and then have them all come to the party and then her, her friends and stuff so I hope y'all like this part alright bye guys <laughs>